inflation data is a major focus for the Reserve Bank of Australia. And you can see early UK time on Wednesday the 26th of July, the headline inflation print is expected to come in at 6.2% down from 7%. The trim mean, which is the core reading, is expected to come down from 6.6 to 6%. Now, if we see a headline inflation print coming in below minimum expectations at 5.7% or lower, and if we see the RBA trim mean coming in below markets minimum expectations of 5.9 at 5.8% or lower, then that should result in Australian dollar downside because it should give the RBA confidence to remain on hold for rates and not necessarily need to hike interest rates again. Also, note that the Aussie US dollar has a pronounced period of weakness ahead. From a seasonal perspective, over the last 15 years, the Aussie US dollar pair has fallen nearly 90% of the time for an average fall of 1.80%. The largest fall was in 2008 during the global financial crisis for a drop of over 9% major trade risks. There are significant risks with this outlook, the main one being the Fed meeting on Wednesday later on in the day. Uh, if the Fed say that they've done and they've finished hiking interest rates, that could result in significant dollar weakness, which could support the Aussie US dollar higher. So remember, the dollar is a key risk to this outlook to be aware of. Remember that HYCM clients can access the Seasonex product in order to analyze over 25,000 different currencies, indices, commodities, as well as individual stocks. And all you need to do is contact your account manager for a free trial and you can get started right away. Certain products and services mentioned herein may or may not be available to all clients, depending on which HYCM Capital Markets Group entity their trading account adheres to.